round my Indiana homestead as they sang in years gone by. Now the basketballs are flying and they almost hide the sky. For where candlelights are gleaming through the sycamores afar, every son of Indiana shoots his basket like a star. Grandland Rice, 1913. In the cradle of the sport, when the game was just growing up, an Indiana farm boy shot baskets at a hoop his father had forged out of iron. The nearest town was Martinsville, population 4,800, except on game nights when the gym that sat 5,228 was filled every time. In this world, schoolboys could become heroes and by leading Martinsville High to the Indiana State Championship, Johnny Wooden became a Hoosier legend. He went on to set Big Ten scoring records at Purdue University and was named All-American three years running. In Massachusetts, they put him in the Hall of Fame, but back home it was said he was the king, the idol of every kid with a basketball. In Indiana, that was every kid. Four decades later, the schoolboy hero had grown into the consummate coach. At UCLA, they called him the Wizard of Westwood, but the only magic he ever used was common sense. And with undefeated season after undefeated season, he conjured up the greatest dynasty in the history of college sports. No team had ever won more than four NCAA championships. UCLA won seven in a row and 10 in 12 years. Their 88-game winning streak remains the longest ever in any sport at this level of competition. Some call him the greatest coach who ever lived, but what sets John Wooden apart is that even in his 90th year, just winning has never been his standard of success. I coined my definition of success in 1934, and I wouldn't change it today. My definition of success is peace of mind attained only through self-satisfaction in knowing you made the effort to do the best of which you're capable. And only you as an individual will know whether you did that or not. You can fool others, but you can't fool yourself. As long as you know that you made the effort to do the best of which you're capable, there's no failure. You might be outscored in a game, but if you've made the effort to be uh, to execute to the best of your ability and have done the things that are important uh, uh, to bring that about, then I don't think you, you fail. It's like reputation and character. Reputation is what others perceive you to be. Character is what you are. And you as an individual are the only one that will really knows uh, uh, what you are. Mm -hmm.